Hello and welcome. In this video, I will show you how to schedule a local notification. First, in our project, let's add a button. Let's give it a title. Fire notification. And let's create an action. With name, fire btn, and hit connect. Very nice. Now, the first thing we need to do is to go to the app delegate .shift file, and here in the did finish launching with options, we want to register our application for local notification settings. First, we create a variable notif types as UI user notification type to be equal UI user notification type dot alert. We also want UI user notification type dot badge and UI user notification type dot sound. Now we want another variable. With name notif settings. as UI user notification settings to be equal for types and here we want our notif types and categories nil and our last part here UI application dot cert application dot register user notification settings and our notification settings is notif settings very nice so now let's go to our view controller dot swift file and let's write the code inside the fire btn action we want a variable notification as UI local notification to be equal to UI local notification. We want notification.alertBody. This is the message it will be displayed when the user receives the local notification. This is a local notification. And now we want notification dot fire date. Fire date is the date time that we want our project to fire our notification. So for test purpose here, what we are going to do is that we are going to take the current date and time when the user pressed the button, add 10 seconds and display our notification. So comment this one and let's create our daytime variable. First we want the variable the date to be equal to NS date. This will retrieve the current date time. Next we want the variable with name date comp. To be equal to NS date components. We want date comp dot second to be equal to 10, 10 seconds. Now we want a variable cal 
to be equal to NS calendar dot current calendar. And now we want our variable with name fire date as NS date to be equal to cal dot date by adding components. And our components is date comp variable to date the date and options ns calendar options dot all zeros. Very nice. So now we have our fire date variable. So here notification dot fire date is equal to fire date. And our last step UI application dot set application dot schedule local notification. And our notification is notification. Very nice. So let's run our application now. You see that it asks for permission to send notification. We hit OK and we fire our notification and we minimize to our home screen. So we wait 10 seconds and as you can see, we have our notification. Very nice. And this is the end of our video. Thanks for watching.